Things I wish I knew before playing Tears of the Kingdom. If you had horses registered in Breath of the Wild, then they'll actually transfer over to Tears of the Kingdom. So there's no need to get a wild horse because you can just take your horses from Breath of the Wild. You can use Link's abilities together, sort of like a combo. For example, if I put a rock really high and then let it go back down and then use Recall, and then use Ascend, then I can go through the rock. So these abilities do have a lot of potential, so try and get creative with it. This game is hard like really hard so if you die a lot then it's perfectly fine i died a lot too it's nothing to be mad or sad about it's not like you're bad at the game this game is just genuinely like seven times harder than breath of the wild and i went in playing this game thinking that it was going to be as easy i was very wrong whenever you find a light route in the depths that also means that there's a shrine right on top in the sky or on the surface and vice versa. Just a nice little way to make completing all the light routes and shrines a little bit easier. Recall can actually be turned into a pretty useful oh, weapon. Okay. Oh my. Oh. Gleox are really hard to kill, but one way of making them easier is to use eyeballs to home into their heads and then the fight will become sort of a breeze. Just make sure to not get hit by its last attack. This game will have frame drops. It does not run perfectly, Although it does run pretty well for a game that's bigger than Elden Ring um, on a device that is partly handheld. Although it, do it does run good for that, it still does have its frame drops which suck. Um, so just prepare for that. And if you're used to 60 FPS, then that may take away from the experience. For me it didn't because I like play Breath of the Wild every day. I'm not used to 60 FPS at all. It's better to explore more than beat the game really fast. I beat the game pretty fast, I just beat it today, and I've gotten um, the true ending and 35% in the game, so I haven't really, you know, done that much. But I probably should have explored a little more um, instead of deciding to beat the game now. I just, I really wanted to. Um, and it's not a bad thing to beat the game early, but you know, it, it may be a little more fun if you just focus on exploring and don't focus on the main quest too much. But that's just me. I could be wrong. Um, but yeah. Anyway, subscribe if you enjoyed the video.